Well, a program to protect your family. Taking care of a loved one who suffers from Alzheimer's or dementia means constant worries about wandering off. And tonight, ABC Action News reporter Maricela Burgos spotlighting a brand new technology that's gaining popularity. Hi, right, buddy. Deputy Jeff Turner. Hey, buddy. And his bloodhound Maverick tracked down a missing woman Sunday. So I had a friend that knew that I lived on that street and he called me up and said, hey, we have a missing person. It's your neighbor. Can you help us out? He called up his supervisor who gave him permission. I know I'm on light duty. I'm not supposed to work, but it's my neighbor and she's missing. You see, Turner and Maverick spent Friday night chasing after a bad guy through the woods. But that's where I have one stuck under my fingernail. Injuring himself after dozens of cactus needles pierced his body. His injury didn't stop him from searching. We started the track and found her about, about a quarter mile late, later on Hammock Road. Pretty, pretty busy street. If she would have had one of these on, deputies could have tracked her much faster. Should she escape somehow and, and, and he can't find her immediately, then we can track her down with that. 48 people are signed up for the safety net program in Highlands County. It uses an antenna to keep tabs on the person wearing the bracelet if they've wandered off. Yeah, it made life a lot easier. Linda Addis yeah, takes right. care of Vivian. Because I don't have to worry about her wandering out of the house. She sent her up for the program shortly after it started. I've never had her to do that, but with dementia, you never know. You know, that can be something that doesn't happen today, but tomorrow could be different. Several counties use safety net, including Pasco, Hillsborough, and Pinellas. I recommend it to everybody. I mean, to anybody that has even a child that, you know, an autistic child or something like that, you never know. And safety, in my opinion, comes first. It's free to sign up for the program in Highlands County. Maricela Burgos, ABC Action News.